to know there's a dragon so let's say he said he said across the river head north uh oh a little bit uh, more complicated than it should have been for a person that doesn't even know who he is who has no memories and yet because this is all muscle memory this fighting I don't know how I'm doing it but hey it is what it is the Imperial Is that a giant? yourself well you could make for a decent shield brother no really you think so can I join you not for me to say you'll have to talk to Codlac Whitemane up in Gravaskar the old man's got a good sense for people he can look in your eyes and tell your worth if you go to him good luck well thanks for the recommendation The companions. This rain is something else. I can barely see. I need to stick to to my mission here. See the Jarl. Tell him about the dragon. Wonder I don't end up falling off a bridge or something that I can't even see. It's insane. Look, the gates Port. are open. Oh, City's then. closed with the dragons about. Official business only. Oh, so you already know about the dragons. Well, I have news from Helgen about the dragon attack. Fine. But we'll be keeping an eye on you. You do that.
We'll pay whatever it takes, but we must have more swords for the Imperial soldiers. I just can't fill an order that size on my own. Why don't you swallow that stubborn pride of yours and it's ask your Imperial little Imperial soldier. For help? <laughs> I'd sooner bend my knee to Ulfric's Stormcloak. Besides, Greymane would never make steel for the Legion. Have it your way. I'll take the job, but don't expect a miracle. Excuse me, Grey Mane or Battleborn? I'm Malachi. I choose Battleborn. Then I say, well met, friend. I can tell you were a sharp one the moment I laid eyes on you. All right. So you say your name is Adoloth. Battleborn. It's a pleasure. I'm hoping to join the Imperial Legion one day. Long live the Empire. Yes, long live the Empire. I breathe now in royalty. I breathe. And he said, keep going up. So you can go no higher. For I love you. I <laughs> what would you have me do then? Nothing? My Lord, What's the please. meaning of this interruption? No Jarl Balgruf is not receiving visitors. Well, he's gonna be seeing me. I have news from Helgen about the dragon attack. Well, that explains why the guards let you in. Come on then, the Jarl will want to speak to you personally. You think? Jarl? So, you were at Helgen. You saw this dragon with your own eyes? Unfortunately, yes, I did. The dragon destroyed Helgen, and last I saw, it was headed this way. By Ismir, Irileth was right. What do you say now, Proventus? Shall we continue to trust in the strength of our walls against the dragon? My lord, we should send troops to Riverwood at once. It's in the most immediate danger. If that dragon is lurking in the mountains, the Jarl of Falkreath will view that as a provocation. He'll assume we're preparing to join Ulfric's side and attack him. We should Enough. not. I'll not stand idly by while a dragon burns my hold and slaughters my people. Irileth, send a detachment to Riverwood at once. Yes, my Jarl. If you'll excuse me, I'll return to my duties. That would be best. Well done. You sought me out on your own initiative. You've done White Run a service, and I won't forget it. Here, take this as a small token of my esteem. There is no, thank you. another thing you could do for me. Suitable for someone of your particular talents? Perhaps. You must help me. Come, we need let's go find Faringar, my court now. wizard. What would you He's been do, looking Rangar? into a matter related your to these dragons the and... No rumors question of judgment. dragons. I'm not asking you to defy the Yarl. Yeah, it's interesting that he's been researching dragons and, and one just to appeared. To the war. You're his steward. He'll listen to you. Leave me out of your intrigues, Rongar. If you have something to say to the Yarl, say it with your own tongue. Faringar. I think I've found someone who can help you with your dragon project. Go ahead and fill him in with all the details. Well, you're no companion, but I suppose you'll do. <laughs> I'd like you to fetch something for me. An so ancient Edward, stone tablet it? inscribed with a map of Skyrim. No, right, that's straightforward enough. I don't need details, just point me in the right direction. Straight to the point, eh? No need for tedious hows and whys. I like that. Leave those details to your betters, am I right? Betters? It's somewhere in Bleak Falls Barrow. 
an old tomb really? south of here. The tomb should be abandoned, so all you'll have to do is exhume some corpses. The stone was probably buried with someone of import, a priest perhaps, or a great warrior. The ancient Nords built lavish crypts for their honored dead, so look for the most elaborate stonework. You know, if you've got the aptitude, you should join the Mage's College in Winterhold. Dragons. We need it quickly, before it's too late. Of course, Jarl Valgroof. You seem to have found me an able assistant. I'm sure he will prove most useful. Succeed at this, and you'll be rewarded. White Run will be in your debt. All right. Let me see, let me check out this armor that he gave me. Studded Imperial, so it's 28. Oh, it's the same thing. All right. Need to sell off some of this stuff that I Sir, picked really up. Talk. It's a shame, isn't it? What's that? It's a shame, isn't it? What? What's a shame? Grace of Kinneret be with you. They say Helgen got hit by a dragon. Yeah, I was there. Comes here. We'll be ready. I hope you're right. Mr. No, I can't. It took me weeks to find that thief's dead. I can't stop now. And I can't get the sword on my own. So you're willing to starve your wife and daughter to reclaim some rusty old sword? I just need to hire one, maybe two good men. You won't starve. I'll put it plainly. You can claim your sword or you can keep your wife. If you set foot outside that gate, mm. I won't be here when you All right, I'm gonna stay out of this. They can barely tolerate our Sapphire. Wait, I... Ah, he sold them, was it? What brings you to the market? I'm here to buy food, Nazim. I suppose you don't need to worry about that. Owning a farm... Let's see, I think if this is the general store. Take a good look around. I'm sure you'll find what you're looking for. If not, let me know. I might have it stored away. I'd even buy one of your relatives if you're looking to sell. <laughs> that's not funny. Yeah, that's, what have you got for sale? Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. I can get rid of that. All right, thank you. 
do come back. Alchemy shop with me. See if she has any cure disease potions. Uh, well, hello. Hello. Where are you going? I offer remedies. I have several elixirs for sale. Okay, let me see what you've got. Take a look. Okay, cure disease. How much are these? All right, I'll go for two. Thank you. Come back anytime if you need a remedy. Do you mind if I... Since drawing me into this room. Huh. An alchemy book. Sorry, I just had to read it. Uh, do you mind? I have some books that I need to read. It's pouring down rain outside. It's nice and warm and cozy in here. I hope you don't mind. healing. Hmm. Yeah. I still don't know how I'm doing this. Sparks. Spectral Wolf. All right, healing hands. No, it's it's too difficult. I, I can't grasp it. What else? How about courage? Oh, nice. Frenzy. going to be it for now. I suppose I could try calm. There. Thank you. Thank you for allowing me to read in your store. I'll I'll be back. Actually, what kind of um, poisons do you have? I have several elixirs for sale. So you're interested in my potions and ingredients? Cure injury, oh boy. <laughs> Weak poisons, all right. Thank you. Come back anytime if you need a remedy. I offer remedies for ailment.
Well, when you look at this, clear skies. Can we close up the sand early today, Mama? I'm afraid not. Little Chops and steaks fit for a yard. Oh, 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 because it's always true. I spend a lot of time can at the market stall so I can learn the merchant's trade. Oh. I need more experience and if I'm going to I run was going to feed you cabbages and apples again. Once I've made enough money trading with the Khajiit caravans, I'm going to buy the bannered mare from Hulda. Oh, that's ambitious. So you're looking to become a merchant. Before my ma and da passed, I told them that one day, I'd become the best trader in Skyrim. I met one of the caravan leaders, Madron. He said he'd help me get started if I could bring him a mammoth's tusk. Easier said than done. Well, maybe I can help you. You'd do that? Sure. If you find one, I could teach you a thing or two about trading. Help you get a fair bargain in the future? Okay. Farewell. Deal. Beats and baubles for sale. All crafted by the best Tired of blacksmith in Had enough Skyrim. fish you found. Treat yourself and your kin to a choice cut of steak or a tender rack of ribs. Oh. Wait a minute. I just... No okay. I was so busy talking to this soldier. I, can this I didn't notice it started raining again. It was, it was bright and sunny. And now look. Wow, this weather... I kind of feel like a, a puppet. It's like I'm being drawn towards certain areas and places. And I'm not sure why. Hello? Is anyone home? I spend so Hello, much sir. time among the dead, I saw... Tell me, do you believe in mighty R.K., god of life and death? Well... I do believe in higher powers. So... I'll say... That I'm not sure. The gods really aren't a big part of my life right now. I see. Well, perhaps you'll take pity on a humble priest who has lost something precious. And what did you lose? My amulet of Arche. Mm. It's the source of my divine powers Power. and also a sacred badge of office. Okay. I misplaced it in the catacombs. I'd look for it, but I have been hearing noises down there. I fear the dead have become restless. Without that amulet, I'm powerless to confront them. Would you be willing to search for it? <laughs> oh, sure, why not? I'll just wait here and make sure nothing foul escapes the catacombs. You do that. The blessing of R.K. be upon you. I take it the catacombs are over here. Here goes everything. I still wish I knew how I know how to fight. Oh.
sure nobody will miss the those coin purses. Holy mo what's this? That was it, just three skeletons, easily beaten. But you know, I really do need more power. I'm not sure why I'm here, but whatever it is, I'm gonna need more power to accomplish. spend so much time among priest the anders with this terrible war i'm a bit overwhelmed i I've found your had... amulet oh thank okay please take this gold for your troubles 15 gold okay and the blessing of RK be upon you i understand you probably took a vow of poverty but i appreciate the little bit of gold that you gave me have a good day you know, I'm thinking while I'm here, maybe I should talk to the companions. They're supposed to be fierce warriors. They probably help me develop my skills. Are those two at it again? Watch the fight. I haven't seen your face before. I'm watching you. This is a place for warriors, New Blood. What brings you here? Um, were you gonna talk to me or are you just gonna walk away? Can I join the companions? So you think you have what it takes? Huh. Lucky for you, I'm not the one who makes that decision. Talk to Codlack. Who knows? Maybe he's in a generous mood. Maybe. All right, then. Where can I find Lucas is a better talker than me. He should be around someplace. Okay. Where can I find Codlack? All right, thank you. Make a left down the stairs. Another left. Make a right. Oh. It's a tall. Oh, you're Khajiit. Hello. Hmm? Oh, apologies. This one was distracted. All right, well, greetings. This one bids you welcome, but perhaps you will come back another time, 
Yes. Yes. But I still hear the call of the blood. We all do. It is our burden to bear. But we can overcome. You have my brother and I, obviously. But I don't know if the rest will go along quite so easily. Leave that to me. No, don't stop on my account. Uh, can I speak to you now? A stranger comes to our hall. I'd like to join the companions. Would you now? Yes. Here, let me have a look at you. Hmm. Yes, perhaps. A certain strength of spirit. Master, you're not truly considering accepting him. I am nobody's master, Vilkas. And last I checked, we had some empty beds in... Gorvasker, for those with a fire burning in their hearts. Apologies. But perhaps this isn't the time. I've never even heard of this outsider. Sometimes the famous come to us. Sometimes men and women come to us to seek their fame. It makes no difference. What matters is their heart. And their arm. Of course. Don't mind me. How are you oh, battle, oh, boy? Oh, oh, I was just checking out your books. Um, I have much to learn. That's the spirit. Vilkas here will get started on that. Vilkas, take him out to the yard and see what he can do. I don't seem so excited about it, Vilkas. Is this real, the sunlight? Or is it still raining? <laughs> it's raining and there's no sun at all. The old man said to have a look at you. So, let's do this. Just have a few swings at me so I can see your form. Don't worry, I can take it. Not bad. Next time won't be so easy. You might just make it. But for now... You're still a whelp to us, new blood. So you do what we tell you. Here's my sword. Go take it up to Yorland to have it sharpened. And be careful. It's probably worth more than you are. Huh. <laughs> huh. Right. really working the forge out in this rain. Suppose he is. Excuse me. What brings you here? Vilkas sent me with his sword. I'm guessing you're the newcomer then. I guess you guess right. Does Vilkas always send newcomers on errands? Oh, don't worry too much about it. They were all whelps once. They just might not like to talk about it. And don't always just do what you're told. Nobody rules anybody in the Companions. 
Well, somebody has to be in charge. Well, I'm not sure how they've managed it, but they have. No leader since Ysgrimor. Kodlak is the harbinger, and he's a sort of advisor for the whole group. But every man is his own. Every woman, her own. Are you a companion? Not actually a companion myself, but none of them know how to work a forge properly, and I'm honored to serve them. My name is Eorlin Greymane. I work the Skyforge. Best steel in all of Skyrim. All of Tamriel. I think I've heard of it. The Skyforge. All right, well, it's been a pleasure. I need to go. I have a favor to ask. Oh, what? I've been working on a shield for Aela. My wife is in mourning, and I need to get back to her soon. I'd be much obliged if you could take this to Aela for me. All right. That's a good man. If you wish to hunt with me, your Isgrimor himself wouldn't have the patience to deal with all the rabble around here. <laughs> I have your shield. Ah, good. I've been waiting for this. Good to see you made it up here. You know this one? I saw him training in the yard with Vilkis. Ah, yes. I heard you gave him quite a thrashing. Don't let Vilkis catch you saying that. Do you think you could handle Vilkis in a real fight? Oh, uh, well, um, I don't care for boasting. Ah, a man of action. Here, let's have Farkas show you where you'll be resting your head. Farkas. Did you call me? Of course we did, Icebrain. Show this new blood where the rest of the whelps sleep. New blood? Oh, I remember you. Come on, Come follow on. me. Look how dark it is in here. <coughs> Skior and Ayala like to tease me, but they're good people. They challenge us to be our best. Nice to have a new face around. It gets boring here sometimes. Mm, you really? I hope we keep you. This can be a rough life. The quarters are up here. Just pick a bed and fall in it when you're tired. Telma will keep the place clean. She always has. All right, so here you are. Looks like the others are eager to meet you. Come to me or Ayala if you're looking for work. Once you've made a bit of a name for yourself, Skior and Vilkas might have things for you to do. Good luck. Welcome to the Companions. By the way, I think if you're you. looking for something to do, we've got trouble right here in Whiterun Hold. Nothing we can't handle. Oh, really? What kind of trouble? Nothing but a bunch of lonely bandits. Cowards who will take little effort. I'll take care of it. Good. Do not spare them your blade. The latest recruit, right? Wait, is that right? What time is it? Oh, seven. I might as well get some rest. It's been a busy day. recruit, right? Wait, is that right? I've been tending to the warriors of your Vasker for as long as I can remember.
off to take care of those bandits. Oh, wait, what's this? Oh. The very idea is well, at least that wasn't considered stealing. Yes, Housecar. We'll leave immediately. It's just us against the dragon. Is that it? I can't afford to send anyone else. We don't know where the dragon is. Your main job will be to keep an eye out and get the people to safety if the town is attacked. I don't expect the three of you to fight off a dragon by yourselves, but I do expect you to do your duty. Of course. We'll keep Riverwood safe. You can count on it. Let's move out. Time's a wasting. All right, Alvor will certainly be happy that we got some guards to come and look after Riverwood. Now, if I can find this uh, bandit camp. I should level up. use a horse to keep that in mind looks like that horse needs to be tamed things. Wait. What am I? That many bandits? And they're coming. of these arrows. I think I'm, oh! Dogs, too. A little hip squeak like you think they can take me on? Oh, I know I can take you on. Anybody else? Believe that, that that many bandits. I got feel like I've been set up. Oh, 
this isn't good. I'm, I'm like caught in the middle. running. They're fighting mud crabs. There's a third person out here somewhere. with arrows. Not 
be scared. You hear me? Death! <laughs> 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 I don't know if I can keep fighting these people. There's too many. Yours clean off. Yeah. If it's uh. oh, I don't know how I'm doing this. Help me. 